Welcome everyone back to Jedi Fallen Order and still don't know where to go but um as for what we where we got from last time I think this is this is just a, you know an exploration route where you can go um so I don't think it was necessary but maybe it was actually because we learned wall jump on the last episode wall run so to say but um so i guess we actually had to go there yep okay to learn that as you can see we get a lot of op obstacles here that need wall running so i assume it was necessary to go there uh maybe i couldn't have advanced without that place i think i thought it would be like an off-track side quest type of thing. So let's see what we have. A new lightsaber switch acquired. If I only could build somewhere, customize it somewhere. But I can't right now. What the heck? I could actually put the bridge down. Well, let's do that. Uh, also, let's try the dash attack. How do you dash attack? Wait, how did you dash attack? What the heck? Can I... Can we do something about it? It's red. Force? Whoa, I almost fell down. Okay, I don't think there's something we can do here. I thought I could grab that chest, but never mind. Okay, I thought I'm gonna fall down. There we go. Shortcut unlocked. Yes. Was there anything? Wait. My health. In case you're asking what's going on, I was actually fighting. Uh. That th frog monster. There was another one. In case you guys are wondering, this is a blind run. Like, this is my f first time I'm playing this. I came back here. Why? Can I look at the map? Wait, what was the map? Oh, okay, so there we go. Reach the vault. Reach the vault. Well, where am I? Oh, am I actually going that? Going there? Looks like in front of me. I mean, we got that chest, but fuck off. Yeah. Uh, climb, of course. Ah, okay. Bam. Okay. Ooh, that that building is huge. Racy there. Oh, it's on. Shit is huge. Wait. Before I go there, let me see what's over here. Hmm. 
What if this is a shortcut? If this is a shortcut... Maybe it's not. Mysterious skeleton. Kind of feel like I bet I, I went a little bit too far. Maybe I should have gone to the vault. Yeah, maybe I should have gone to the vault. Hold on. Okay, we're going back to the vault now. No. See first what's there and go, then go. Okay. Then, okay, he probably would have won. Probably. Then, then go back. Meditate for- wait, first I want to learn a new skill, it seems like. I guess. Is it now wall jumping, like Metroid? Yeah. See, that's what I want. Why I wanted to go back and check things out. Like, should I go back? What the heck? I guess I can explore it later. I guess. I hope. See what's behind here. Got a scan? What? Okay, I can't do much about these. Whoa. Wait. Wait, can, why can't I enter it from the back? That's weird. Amazing. What the hell? Okay. Oh no! Right, well oh, Braytech! <laughs> Buster Braytech. And gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Eno Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault, is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. Never interrupt. <laughs> Master Braytek. So I'm gonna... Hold on. Let's let's Guess let's see. Someone I was supposed to meet. You know, I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. There's no way to live. Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. 
Maybe we're done hiding. Hey, you want to meet some uh, friends of mine? All right, okay, so what I was saying is that character you just saw on a hologram is the actor that played Master Braytag on Stargate. So if you guys have watched Stargate, I'm a huge Stargate fan. Sad to see that uh, series go down like it, but, you know, it'll always live in in my heart. Okay, so... We have to go back, so I, apparently I can go back, and I hope it won't just spawn me right uh, at the ship, so I can still, you know, explore a little bit around. I think I found what you wanted me to see. Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. That's why well, was one hell of a dirt ride. Whoa! Okay, what the heck? You. Whoa, dude, that sh Okay, now he has a lot of... Oh, shit. Shit, 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 Okay. Uh, fighting him... Hey, he should be fucking... Oh, God. Die! Alright, so he isn't even giving anything. I, those monsters would actually drop something valuable. I guess I'm getting skill points, but you know. Abandoned workshop, can I customize my things, please? Oh, there's something. Hello, please open. Can't get through. I kinda expected it, you know. Oh, he's gonna... It appears the Sefo had some interest in Dathomir. Strange. Dathomir? It's a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. Dathomir? What was that? Dathomir, okay. There we go. I was about to say, if this shit was locked... Ah, oh, hey, look where we are. Should be locked. The beginning area. Okay, so let me see. Do I have any skill points available? No, but let's rest. Okay, so let me see if anything else is around here. I guess not but uh this is actually a perfect place to end the episode so guys we found the vault we got that uh, so apparently the droid was our um you know person whatever that we uh, were going to meet or met now so uh our objective and uh now we're going back to the ship again to see what's going on and uh on our way we actually unlocked three skill points uh force extension and two new attacks <coughs> but i still couldn't i actually still couldn't figure out how to do that dash attack thing but we'll see that on the next episode but anyway anyhow thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you on the next episode